Okay, hi, I've got my X12 open. I'm, I'm gonna go over here to open plan. Now I'm gonna navigate to Drive C, my documents, Chief Architect Premier X12 data templates. Now I'm gonna find my profile plan as the plan that I want to, uh, I want to uh, edit. We'll open it up. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now I'm going to go over here to and double click on the uh, wall tool right there, which opens this. We'll go to exterior wall, edit. And I just want to see, okay, I've got, uh, go to wall types. Siding four is with white horizontal siding is my uh, default siding. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on define and copy that wall because otherwise it's set up just right except for the exterior material. I'm gonna call this uh, copy T111. <coughs> Excuse me. Now I'm gonna change this white horizontal siding by left clicking on it in this dialog. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I'm going to go to uh, vertical siding, or let's see, we've got board, yeah, board and batten, see? And uh, I don't particularly like that. That's not board and batten anyway. It said board and batten, but I don't think, I don't think any of these are. Well, that's BS, I'm sorry. Okay, let's, uh, hmm. I was a little bit surprised by that. Uh, let's try vertical panel. That doesn't look particularly like, uh, no, that didn't look like board and bat. So that's not a solution. Well, I thought this was gonna be easy. <laughs> Let me take a look. No, none of those are okay. <sighs> well, doodle daddle. I guess they've changed the library. That, that all those all suck. Well, let me see uh, in my user library if I've got something. I'm sorry about that. I thought this was going to be easy. Let me go to my materials. And see if I can find something. What is that? Well, I better wait till it initializes. Okay, that's just everything. What's that? No, that's no good. That's better, but that's no good either. Okay, so my textures doesn't have it. See, board and batten. There we go. Oh, the texture's missing. God blast it. <laughs> this is a cheap architect user named Sam who created a, a board and bat texture. Now, well, let me see if I can find the thing. Uh, let's see. How do I? That's not it. Well, this video is going to be longer than I thought it was. Sorry about that. It's lattice. Don't need lattice. <clears throat> See, I downloaded this thing and then the texture got disassociated. Uh, let me just leave that now. I've created this wall type. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to go user. I'm going to see if I can find that Sam texture. Where is it? Oh, it's in my, uh, that's right. It's over here under uh, my materials. I forgot. Yeah, there it is. <clears throat> now with this, See, there's a pattern file, but 
Oh, wait a minute, it's showing the, oh, look at that. I'm gonna go, uh, wait a minute, that wasn't what. That's, that's a symbol. This is uh, the one I'm looking for. I don't want to search attributes. I want to find that frickin' texture. I don't want to export the library. Okay, we'll go over here and I'm going to see if I can find the texture by, let's see, that's that. I'm going to copy that and go back up and click on browse. See, it's not in this folder it were, or it would pick it up. So that's my textures. Look at textures. Okay, what I'm gonna do then is I'm gonna go um, over here to Windows. No, yeah. Don't want that, want this, yeah. <coughs> I'm gonna go to, uh, all my stuff is on, on Drive E, so I'm going to search Drive E for this. Uh, I'm going to shorten that name down. If I can. I can't. Okay. I don't need that E. <laughs> I just want the file name, and I, I'm having trouble. Uh, uh, boy, oh boy. Well, we'll just try that. That's a little bit too specific. I'm looking for the, the, the image that might exist in some folder other than the folder it's supposed to be in. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna help or not. This is what you have to go through every now and then if you don't carefully uh, ride herd on your texture files and keep them all in one place, which I thought I did in that X, 10 and X11 is probably in an X10 or an X11 folder. I didn't transfer it over. <coughs> now just hang in. This may be what you have to do yourself. I don't know. Probably not. If all you have is X12 on your computer, then see I've got X I've got versions seven through X12 on my computer. That's seven through twenty-two. So mine's my hard drive's a little bit more complicated than probably yours is. This is probably not gonna work after after spending this time on a search. And I'm sorry for that, for that, but uh, you got my apology. Uh, okay, I finally found that texture and put it where it needs to go, and I'll explain that in a moment. Thank you for your patience. Now I'm going to. Click here and uh, let's see how it Where is that thing? I support and that, yeah. That's right, I want the dialogue for that. Open object, that's what I was looking for, sorry. Not my best day. I'm gonna go to the texture tab now that I know where that frickin' texture is. And you can see here it's blank. <clears throat> I'm gonna go to textures, my textures, which I've now put that, there it is there. And I'll upload this so you can, there's also a normal here for board and bat, but Right now we're just talking about the texture. 
See, now we got a, a texture that looks like more than that. And also, let's see, let's turn that way. And here's a normal map. I'm going to go browse normal. <clears throat> For high resolution renders and so forth, it just makes it look more realistic. Okay. <clears throat> so now that's called board and bat sound. I'm going to, now that I've got that material existing, now I'm going to go, <coughs> excuse me, to uh, edit default settings, walls, exterior wall. And I'm going to go to wall types, and there's that X111 now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> X111, sorry, T111. And we'll change this mat horizontal material for that uh, material I just created. We'll go to library materials, <coughs> excuse me, user catalog, my materials, Sam's board and back. Like I said, I'm going to upload those norm the normal and the file when I'm done with the video. Where is that thing? Maybe it's more than bat sand. Yeah, there it is. <clears throat> so I created this custom wall type, added it to my profile plans library, and it's currently set as the default. Now I'm going to close this here and uh, yeah, we'll save. I'm going to go over here to File, New Plan. I'm sorry. File, New Plan. Opens a copy of the, that. Over here to, excuse me, I need to zoom out a little bit. <clears throat> okay. Now I'm going to uh, do an overview of this and you'll see that my default material is that. If you want to set it some other default, you just open your profile plan and, but in this case, I created this custom wall style and then I added it to my profile plan. So now it's going to be available for all my future plans. Okay. Hope this helps you. And if it doesn't, well, have a great day.